So that is every single mob farm in one, except for the wither. But can you even make a wither farm? Ooh. The way arrows deal damage is based off how fast they're going. So if an arrow is going fast enough, it can one-shot any mob. So basically we're making a giant dispenser that shoots an arrow at light speed, except some of these trees are in the way. And there we go, all the trees are gone. Let's build the dispenser. Slight, slight hiccup. I kind of ran out of wool and by ran out, I mean, I never had any. So, uh, and boom. And last blocks, boom. It is completed. Oh yeah, this thing looks sick. Okay, so the dispenser is finished. However, that's just the outside because as of right now, there's nothing on the inside. What I'm gonna do is set up some sort of like a cannon thingy maybe that can like shoot an arrow super fast at a wither and kill it one shot, I hope. I shoot the arrow, I flip the lever, and bombs away. I might have to find a one that actually works online. Nice! Ooh, all right, I did it. That's 25% of it done. <laughs> okay, the machine is fully built, I think. Uh, no idea if I did it right, but I don't have any TNT and I need to fill it up with TNT. So, uh, let me go find some TNT. Well, my mama farm is trash, so I have zero gunpowder. Time to go kill some creepers, I guess. That should be enough gunpowder. I got almost three stacks. Uh, hopefully I can fill all the dispensers with it. Okay, that wasn't even close to enough TNT. I filled not even half of the dispensers. Great. I think what I'm gonna have to do is just make a gunpowder farm because manually gathering all of this gunpowder is not worth it. So I need a ton more TNT. I'm just gonna make a new mob farm on the side that gets gunpowder. And with those blocks broken, I believe that the farm is completely finished. Oh yeah, it's working. All right, I'm gonna quickly do a quick AFK session here and get as many gunpowder as possible. Okay, I've been waiting long enough. Oh my goodness! It's raining cats and dogs. Oh, snap! Yep, this one's pretty good. Okay, I have primed the machine and I got a big old wall right there. Uh, hopefully the arrow will hit the wall and then I can figure exactly where the arrow goes and then I'll spawn a wither there and shoot the wither, one shot, kill the wither. Okay, so I press that one. Press that one. Look at that, look at that, look at that arrow. Boom, it was like instantaneous. I wonder how much damage it does to a player. Hold on, I am going to withstand this arrow. Watch this guys. Okay, so we're gonna prime it. Then as soon as I press that, I gotta beam out of here. Oh, it missed me. I just saw it land in front of me, no. Oh, I have an idea. I place a target block here and then I shoot the target block with an arrow. I can have a little head start of going towards over here. Okay, I think I have enough time if I do it from here. Oh, I got it. I'm a menace. Shoot me. Oh, holy cow. No, what happened? What? Okay, so holy cow. It worked, but it also blew up. Um, interesting. No, I have to remake this whole thing. Oh. The good news is it does a lot of damage because it uh killed me, basically. It popped the totem. Oh, and that also means I lost all that TNT. Actually, some of the TNT is still here. <laughs> Okay, so the plan is I have the dispenser here, it'll shoot, and there'll be a wither inside of that, and that will be what kills- Actually- Wait. I have an idea. I should make a massive wither out of, like, wool and stuff, and then giant dispenser shoots at a giant wither, and with a little wither inside that cage. Genius. Except, I'm gonna need a lot of supplies for that. Ah. Uh, that was not nearly enough supplies for an entire wither, but 
Luckily, in the last episode, I made a sand duper, and I think that that should also work with concrete powder. So if this actually works, then I just flip it at, and I flip it at. Nope, that did not actually work. I very much just broke it. Yeah! Okay, I got a shulker box full and a whole bunch of more black concrete in my inventory. We'll see how far that gets us. Okay, that is one shulker box. And, oh, yeah, that doesn't look great. Uh, <laughs> dang, I thought I had a lot more done than I actually do. All right, I have placed all of the black concrete. I'm pretty sure that it's all in the right spots. But one of the main materials I need is gray wool, and I need so much of it. However, I used up all of my gray wool on the giant dispenser, and then I killed all the sheep in the farm because I ran out of food. So I guess what I need is a wool farm? Okay, there we go. The wool farm is done, except for the fact that uh, there aren't any sheep in here. Wait a minute. I just had the most genius idea. I don't know if this is going to work because they're not actually standing on anything, but uh, let's find out. No way. Dude. Born from space. That's what I'm talking about. Come on, buddy. Promise a good life life that you'll never see. Okay, I've been AFKing for a stupid amount of time, and oh yeah, okay, we got tons of wool. Hit the time lapse button, baby. Um, wait, where did my, oh, vault. Oh. 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 Oh, no. Man, why does this keep happening? Oh, Whew, okay, that is all of the wool placed, I think. Now I have to do concrete powder. Oh yeah, guys, look at that. That is sick. Okay, I think it's time we do it, guys. I got the soul sand and the wither skulls. Let's make a wither. And if I'm not mistaken, the wither can only break obsidian if I'm close enough to him. Okay, okay. Yeah, okay, he's in there. I'm gonna hit that. Oh, what? It didn't damage him? Oh, it missed. How did the arrow miss? Oh, what the? Oh, oh, oh no. He's destroying this wither. This is not good. He's spleefing me. Holy cow. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Dude, he's destroying everything. Oh, no, no. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, there he is. He's right there. He's right there. He's still trying to spleef me. I've almost got him to half health. Okay, he's at half health. Holy balls. Yes. Dude, that's so much of the wither I have to fix. Look at all of this stuff he destroyed. Bro, how am I gonna keep the wither trapped if he blows up even obsidian? Yeah, he blew this whole thing up. Okay, I can't figure that out right now. I gotta, I gotta fix the wither first. Okay, so I finished the wither. I fixed him up and stuff, but the problem is he can still get out of the obsidian in there. So I gotta figure out another way to trap him because obsidian is not doing the job. However, there is one block in the game that withers cannot break. One singular block that no wither no matter how powerful and how many strength potions you give him, how many withers there are in there to break the block. And that block, ladies and gentlemen, is the subscribe button. Oh, wait, no. That block is bedrock. Huh? How am I supposed to get bedrock again? Okay, it turns out there is a way to get bedrock. For every one bedrock, you use up five end crystals. And I need, uh, over a stack of bedrock. I should really quit my YouTube channel. Okay, so because of how much bedrock I need, I need 14 stacks of end crystals as well, which is 14 stacks of gas tears. There's a gas. Guys, this is taking way too long. I'm just flying around using a firework rockets. Maybe there's a way to make a gas farm. Good news, I found a way to make a gas farm. I need some mag blocks. Rail levers. A lot of slabs. Okay, I think that's everything I need. Now I just fill up everything else with magma blocks. Okay, now we're gonna place wither roses on these and, uh, I don't have any wither roses. All right, that was quite the excursion. It's been about another hour or so. Oh yeah, that's enough gas tears right there. Sweet, now the last ingredient I need is blaze powder for eyes of ender. Okay, so there's this spawner here and then another spawner right down here. So I'm just gonna connect these and I'll get these end crystals in no time.
Um, all right, I think that is actually way more than enough because I only need seven stacks because... Oh, I don't have my elytra on. Ah, I'm an idiot. Now the only thing I need left is ender pearls, and good thing for me, I already have an enderman farm, so... Oh yeah, that's right, baby. 14 stacks of end crystals. Now, I believe I can just travel to the end. Place one end crystal there. Then you go here, here, then one there. Then... All right, supposedly that dropped a bedrock item into the portal. And now I just go in here and... I don't see any bedrock. It should have it should have dropped right here, right on the spawn block where these other blocks were. Okay, let's try that again. And bruh, just torches. I'm not trying to make a torch generator here. I'm trying to make a bedrock generator. Why is this not working? Good news, I know why it's not working. Let's take this step by step, otherwise it's gonna be vastly confusing due to all the file moving. This glitch only works in a snapshot version. So, now we make our way to the end dimension, and this end dimension is connected to both a snapshot world and my regular hardcore world. Okay, when I go through here, I should end up in the new end. Okay, this is, this looks like the new end. Now what I have to do is put down a chest. All of this stuff is the stuff that I'm gonna need in the snapshot version. Now we go into the snapshot world, and now my chest is in the end, so I have nothing. One minute. Nope, that's not how I do it. Yeah, that's enough. Let's get out of here. Finally, dude. Now let's go down. Well, uh, I guess this was not the spot. I just found bedrock. What the heck? All right, sweet. I found it. Yes! Okay, sweet. The chest is there now, as long as it's not empty. Oh, bet. Okay, sweet. So, I think I can... Yeah, I place that there. That replaces the top bedrock. Then I go like this, that, that, and then right here, I... Holy cow! Okay. Now I go through here. All right, right here. Oh, yes! <laughs> it did work. Okay, so each time I do that, I get one bedrock. So now I gotta grind this thing out. I'm just gonna go to the end and just do this like crazy. Boom. All right. Let's go through the portal and see how much bedrock we got. Should all be in the hopper. Oh, heck yeah. I got almost two and a half stacks. Now I just go back to the end and put the bedrock into the chest. And then I will travel to my main hardcore world and then go to its end and grab the bedrock. Okay, let's see if this thing works. Oh, I was already in the end. Um. Oh, what? I have bedrock item. I honestly thought that might not work. I'm actually shocked that that worked so well. Okay, boys, let's place this bedrock. <laughs> Dude, I'm just being so careful with every click. I do not want to misplace this. All right, I think I need to go one higher, like so. Okay, if I did this correctly, there should be no way for him to exit this. I can just barely see him. Okay, he doesn't seem to be going anywhere. Charge it up with an arrow. Activate that. Okay, let's watch this happen. Boop. Oh, no. The arrow's one block too short. I can't lower the bedrock. I guess I'm gonna have to raise the piston? Bro. Okay, so I gotta make this entire machine one block higher. I hate my life. Okay, I took it down. Now I have to rebuild it again. All right, I finished building it one block higher. Uh, I sure hope this thing doesn't blow itself up. If it does, I... <laughs> yeah, we don't need to talk about that. Now I flick uh, this. And the wither should die. Hmm, why did the wither not die? Did it miss him? Where did the arrow go? What the heck? Why is the arrow over here? Okay, we're, we're trying that again, guys. What? I don't know what's going on. Load it up. Uh-oh. I just got stuck in here. Oh, that hit him! No way! Look at that, it brought him down to almost half health. Let's do it again, let's do it again, let's do it again, let's do it again. We gotta kill him, we gotta kill him. Uh... Oh! He's almost dead, he's almost dead! One more arrow, one more arrow and he's dead. One more arrow and he's dead. That... I saw the arrow literally hit him. 
Oh! It's because the Wither is invincible to arrows when he's lower than half health. I can't damage the Wither with arrows when he's half health or lower. What else could I launch at him to kill him? Ooh. Wait a minute. What if, instead, I make a different machine that's not this one? It doesn't shoot an arrow. Instead, it shoots TNT, rail cannon style, onto the Wither. Yeah, I guess the first thing to do is take this down again. That was a lot of work. Now I have to figure out how to make a TNT cannon so I can shoot a buttload of TNT at the Wither. Um, I'm going to start making a TNT cannon. I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just going to be making it up. Okay, so I light all these. And then I light that one. And yep. Oh! oh. <laughs> Whoops! Yeah, I'm definitely going to just have to find a tutorial. Okay, there we go. It's fully loaded with TNT. Um, these all have one, and this has two stacks, which it'll use a probably about that much. Okay, now I just have to build the wither, and, uh... Oh, right. I'm completely out of wither skulls. Yeah, there they are. Oh, my goodness. No head? That's unfortunate. Ha! <laughs> Suck it! Okay, this is taking way too long, and I need a lot of wither, so I'm just gonna make a wither skull farm. Okay, so, my very first step in this wither skull farm is to get buttons. Uh-huh. Yeah, I need about 8,000 buttons. I got about a shulker box and a half of buttons, so let's see how far that gets us. Alright, we made it to the nether fortress, and oh my goodness, there's so many things spawning already, this is not good. Now I just have to- I have to button the entire ground. <laughs> okay, all of the buttons have been placed. Now not a single blaze or wither skeleton can spawn. Oh, I just threw my sword. All right, now I gotta whip out my glass. Glass placed. Now I gotta build an iron golem. And the turtle egg. Boom. Okay, now I need to dig down 20 blocks. Now, boom, wither skeleton's going crazy already. I'll see you guys when I have some skulls. Huh, hey buddy. Okay, I've been here for probably 30 minutes or so. Let's see what we got. 18, 10, 18, 46 wither skulls. I think I should be good for quite a while. I say we head back and absolutely destroy a wither. Okay, let's stick the wither in here. All right, I guess I should, uh, I should fire it. Press the button. Here we go. Charging up. TNT drop. Pistons extend. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, he still has some health. What? No way he survives this one. Yeah, buddy. Very nice. Do you think I can spawn multiple guys in here at once? Will one guy break the other? Oh, no way. No way. I just spawned in three. Boom, another one. Yeah, I got another one. Oh my goodness. Here we go, boys. I'm gonna send multiple shots. Boom, they're getting destroyed. Boom, they're getting destroyed. Holy cow. I just killed five at once. Dude, from all of this, 11 nether stars? That's too many beacons. I don't even need that many beacons. This is great. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that. That was insane. Thank you for subscribing. Wait, you did subscribe, right? To my channel. 99% of you aren't even subscribed. Thank you for subscribing. Just click the little red button. I love you so much.